What's going on traders? Welcome back to Gorilla Futures. My name is Patrick and thank you for watching. Today's video is all about scalping the 60 minute chart. But before we get into that, be sure to comment down below, turn on that bell notification and subscribe so you can stay updated on each and every video that we do release. Now the trade that you are about to see here in just a moment is on the micro NASDAQ. We used six contracts and got short for about 15 points. Now this trade only lasted a few seconds and just a little disclaimer, not every single trade is going to end up happening this fast. I know our last video and this video, so our previous two videos have showed trades that pretty much happen like this. Now that is not uncommon, but not every single trade is going to happen that fast, especially on the hourly chart. But one of the ideas behind using the hourly chart and the idea kind of behind our new indicator coming out in a few weeks, in a, in a month or so, is that you can take advantage of the momentum on the 60 minute chart. And that's one of the reasons why I do like to use this 60 minute chart and one of the reasons why I am using it even more lately. Simply wait for the 60 minute signal. If you get a signal, then you jump into a trade either long or short. If not, then you simply wait for the next hour and see if something else comes. Now, if you are a busy, maybe a busy parent, maybe you're working a nine to five, or you simply can't sit in front of the computer all day long, scalping a quick moving chart, such as the one minute, two minute, five minute chart, then the 60 minute chart is one that you should really look at. You can simply set an alarm or set a notification to come back to your charts, maybe 10, 15 minutes, uh, before the close or the close of that candle, I should be more specific and see if there are any trades. So if you do have a nine to five or you're still working or maybe taking care of your children or something like that, definitely look into trading the hourly chart. There's tons of signals. You can scalp it like you will see in this video here in just a moment, or you can do more of a swing type trading approach and still use all the Gorilla Futures signals, entries, and things like that. And as we're talking about the Gorilla Futures entries and signals, there's a link right up above. Click that link, get access to our course where we talk about entry signals, talk about when, where, and how to enter. Now, without further ado, let's take a look at that trade and figure out exactly what happened. What's going on traders? Hope everyone's having a good day. Uh, I am testing out our new hourly strategy that I mentioned in our last video and that was mentioned on our blog last week. Both those links will be down below in the description. We have about nine seconds left till this closes. What you can't see, there are a few indicators off screen that are signaling me into this trade and I'm going to get short. Order submitted. Definitely fumbled that up just a little bit. Let's see if we can get a fill right here. Uh, not gonna chase this at all. Looking to hopefully get short. And let's Order see. Order filled. And we got filled right there. Let me move this over to dollars because I know some of you like to see that. Uh, so let me explain this real quick and we might get filled right away. Tar target filled. And we got filled almost instantly. Um, so let me explain exactly what happened. I know the last trade was like this. Um, I'm honestly extremely surprised um, that these videos or these trades are, are happening that fast. So let me walk you through exactly what's going on. Uh, so we are currently working on an indicator that will be coming out in the next few weeks, possibly a month, uh, two months at the maximum. Uh, but what's going on is the idea behind this is to use price action, a few uh, different volume scenarios, um, and just pretty much our go-to signals to get long and short here on the hourly chart. The idea behind this is for those traders who maybe still work a nine to five, uh, will be able to trade this and we will be able to, or not we, your computer will be able to send you signals as long as that screen is up. So walking you through kind of through this trade and what was going on. First off, we did have a gap down scenario. We can see prices currently trending down. We just made a lower high uh, with that high right around uh, 12,903. 
Um, so pretty much what I was looking at is we got this nice two candle, uh, pretty much two candles back to back. Uh, this is before the New York Open, so I don't trade the pre-market, so that is another reason why I took this. And like I mentioned ago, a minute ago, all my indicators, signals, uh, and pretty much that indicator system that I talked about pointed me to take a short. Now, unfortunately, I won't be able to describe every single uh, item behind this new indicator that we're working on, um, but there are tons and tons of different uh, aspects that go into this that help us kind of identify these trades. Um, so once I know the trend is down, I'm going to start looking for shorts. Once everything does line up, I get a signal and I can go short. Now, not to mention that new indicator, this is also a kind of a textbook price action setup right here as well. Nice two candle. This is actually an engulfing two candle. And I wouldn't be surprised if we do eventually run down, maybe uh, test these lows right around 12,725, or maybe run into some support right around this previous close right around 12,751. Um, so that is kind of the gist behind this, uh, th like I said a moment ago, this will be coming out in the coming weeks and months. Um, and the nice thing about this and what you don't see on screen right now is we will have a nice big red indicator and a nice big green indicator to signal longs and shorts. So it's extremely simple to use. Um, if you have any questions about that, feel free to comment down below. Like I mentioned in our previous video, uh, we will be releasing a series uh, once this indicator is complete to just kind of got kind of give everyone um, some more information about it and a little bit of a run up uh, before we do release it. I definitely got a few questions uh, via email, and if you do have any more questions, feel free to shoot me an email or comment down below about this new system. Once again, the idea behind this is to help those traders who maybe you work a nine to five, maybe you can't. Uh, spend a bunch of time in front of the charts, but you still want to trade. So that's really the idea behind this. As always, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, shoot me an email, comment down below. Uh, I really did hope that you got something out of this video. Again, I do apologize that this video is so short and that trade happened uh, so fast. Unfortunately, some things are out of my hands and some trades end up lasting 5-10 minutes. Some trades end up lasting 15 seconds. Uh, again, got short right around that 12, uh, 12 790 level. Got short for 15 points. Moved down, hit that pretty much instantly, and then obviously I got out. That was six contracts again. So as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for being a Gorilla Future member. Be sure to subscribe, comment down below, turn on that bell notification, and let me know if there's anything I can do to help you out. Good luck.